Hey everyone, it's Jason, your favorite Asian. Favorite, favorite, favorite Asian. So today I'm on my second day trip. So I operated today. So we came from Cairns and we're now in um, Brisbane. We actually had a charter flight and we took some of the AFL footballers. So the free mental dockers, I believe they were. They were quite lovely, but um, yeah, we couldn't really chat to them because we were advised not to. With charters like that, especially with high profile people, we tend to give them privacy and just let them do what they gotta do, especially when I think they were on their way to a next game. So they were lovely, but didn't really get to chat with them. But yeah, but anyways, I'm in Brisbane now, and oh my God, this room is amazing. It is gorgeous, G-A-W. J U S. So I'm gonna do a room tour. This is not usually the hotel that we stay in as well. So I think it's pretty new as well. I've never been in this hotel, but it is quite beautiful. All right, I'll see you soon. Look out for a new room tour. Bye. So this is what the hallway looks like. It's very beautiful. Beautiful carpet. And we're going into my room. So as you come into my hotel room, you get a little nice vestibule here. Probably is missing a pot plant or some form of decorative feature, but that's a little nice space. You get a mirror as well. Full length mirror to check how gorgeous you are before you go to work. Um, and then, check out this light fitting. It's cute. So this wall is actually a curved wall. It hugs along there and this is your little mini bar with some nice wine i think it's a shiraz god i love shiraz oh, it's gonna be tempting not to gonna be hard not to open that your little kettle tea cups sauces little kettle complimentary tea sugar and a bit i believe coffee some glasses and i think this is where the minibar would be so let's have a look yes it is so let's have a look at the minibar yes so milk soda some nice bee oh chocolate yum and water right down there and then obviously your actual cupboards with your usual um, ironing board and iron and some coat hangers. I put my coat up there already. That's the first thing I do, take my coat off because you just want to be comfortable. Um, and obviously more storage there. So that's the view from, that's your front door and you're going through that little hallway and then to the right of the front door, as you go across across this wall, is this beautiful, beautiful bathroom. Look at that. You get a little door for the shower. How cute is that? Oh my God, I'm in love with this. Beautiful, gorgeous um, flooring. Shower head there, cute little set of shower head. Um, I wonder what that is. I think it's like textured glass. Um, and then you go into your little vanity. Um, there's your complimentary amenities. That's gonna come home with me. I love this stuff. So that's gonna come, that's gonna come home with me. My little souvenirs. Um, what is that? Hand sanitizer. Oh my God, how posh. How posh. Um, obviously, your hair dryer. Um, and then your little commode. And this also has a door to close your bathroom of frosted glass. Oh my God, I am in love with this room. It's, oh, um, I love the coloring, the fact that textures, the, oh my god, ah! 
Um, in here, in, this is the living area. So I put my bag there already, creating a mess already. Oh, gorgeous. Gorgeous little print. Um, big bed. I think, it, I think it could be a double, maybe a queen. Just there. Um, there's your desk. Um, and his cute little chair. If I was like, you know, someone that wrote on a journal or did or kept it up, I would have sat here and be like, Dear Diary, today I'm impressed with my hotel room. Motivation to get rich so I can stay in a hotel like this every single day of my life. Um, then there's your little sitting area. Another beautiful chair. I'm in love with this chair. It's like a little textured chair. Kind of like an Aboriginal sort of nature inspired pattern. Your TV is there. Look at this remote control. How cute is that? Um, I think it's just storage in here, you know, just there. And then my view, finally my view of Brisbane. Um, we normally stay closer to the city, like towards those buildings, but I think we just have to cross the bridge. I think that bridge and do a walk. I don't know. I'll do, I'll have to do a GPS. Um, research and see how far we are. But we're normally across the bridge, across the bridge and the lake. If you can see the lake just there, or the river to be precise. Um, but I think that hotel is full, so we're staying in this hotel. Although I wouldn't mind it if we stayed here um, permanently. It's a beautiful room, but it's, it's just a bit of a walk from the city. That's all, maybe five, 10 minutes. But yeah. And this is the room from the window. This hotel, I think I can actually walk around the hotel and not be imprisoned in my room. So I, I might actually go for a wander. And if I do, I'll do more um, videos for it. But yeah, very different from Cairns. It's a lot more obviously because it's the capital city of... Um, Queensland it's much more metropolitan it's not but I feel like Brisbane always has a holiday holiday vibe anyway it's not as um, hectic as Sydney or Melbourne so look at this beautiful building also I'm not telling you guys the name of the hotel because obviously crew stays in the hotel and I don't want obviously to give up any um, confidentiality thingamajigs so sorry about that but yeah but i'm in brisbane so hopefully you enjoyed the room tour and if i did do go like i said if i do go out explore the hotel i'll try and do another video of it but i'll probably just sit here have my cup of tea it's about 11 ish 11 ish um our flight was about six or so or 6 30 so and then we had a one and a half hour drive from the gold coast to brisbane so i'm a little bit i um, tired for some reason, although I've just had one operating flight. Maybe I'm not used to flying anymore since I've been taking a break from it with my frosters being all stand down. Okay, you guys, I hope you enjoy it. See you soon. Bye.